Aloha and welcome to Hula Preservation Society's Digital Umeke. HPS has conducted oral history interviews with Hula elders for over 20 years. Digital Umeke is our virtual collections website, featuring select materials of elder collections from our archive. This tutorial is a brief overview on navigating and accessing materials in the Puluelo Naipo Park collection. Upon visiting Digital Umeke, images of some elders we have worked with are displayed at the top. These remarkable people lived through dramatically changing times in 20th century Hawaii. Their lives in Hula have helped to preserve, perpetuate, and cultivate Hawaiian culture and lifeways. There are a handful of tabs at the very top that can help you use and navigate this site. Scrolling down the page allows you to access areas by featured content and by category. Let's take a look at the collection for Antipuluelo Naipo Park. Click on the top tab titled Collections. This is Hula Master Puluelo Naipo Park. She was born in 1924 on the island of Hawaii. She was very proud of her roots in Kohala, the birthplace of Kamehameha the Great. Auntie Puluelo became interested in hula as a very young girl and sought formal training when the family moved to Oahu. You can learn more about Auntie Pulu and her life's journey through this virtual collection. All of our oral history kupuna have a featured photo with a short summary at the top of their collection page. Below this is a brief section providing insight into how HPS met this elder and what it was like to spend time with them. We got to know Auntie Pulu through one-on-one -on -one interviews and public panel discussions. We came to experience the gift she had for telling her stories. Auntie's foundation was in her family, and she found a fulfilling life through Hula and the students she helped to nurture. What a blessing it was to have had time with this precious elder in her final years. To see the items available in Auntie's virtual collection, scroll down. These records contain photos, interview transcripts, edited video, finding aids, and footage lists to assist you in your research and learning. Let's take a look at Auntie Pulu's person record. Here we have some basic biographical info about Auntie. Some external links for additional sources relating to her are listed at the bottom of the page. The photograph is a painting of Auntie Pulu that captures her as the stately and elegant Hawaiian woman she was. Let's go back to Auntie's main collection page. Another type of record you can use to learn more about Auntie is a digital heritage item record. Let's take a look at an HPS panel discussion Auntie was a part of in 2001 on the island of Hawaii. A viewing carousel with available materials for this panel discussion is displayed at the top of the record. You can watch the entire recorded panel program if you click here. Let's take a peek. My first learning was um, Liliu and Kavika. Those were the two dances that I learned, but the one that I really like is my Pahu, Kaulilua. I'll tell you a little story about that one. It took me almost a year to learn Kaulilua. That's right. Because I was never on the beat. And Lokalia kept saying, no, come back next week, try again study at home and it was so hard I could not get that beat and then finally I got mad because I was way back she was going ahead with other classes because I'm a single uh, person but she had other students they were way past me I got so mad one night I stayed up until one o'clock in the morning chanting by my good thing I live in Palolo way in the boondocks yeah right, right near the water reservoir so nobody could hear me and I worked it and worked it. Next day, tired as I was, she said, I hope you learned. I said, I think so. Then I started with Kaole Lua. And when I passed, she said, hooray. See, I could do my other two, which was Awa Ia and um, Akoolawa. I could do those two, but I could never get my Kaole Lua. When I finally made it, she says, oh, 
it's about time. I was wondering when you're going to finish. <laughs> that was my uh, graduation time. There is a transcript of the panel discussion if you would like to read the conversation along with the video or without the video. Depending on your system and browser, the transcript may automatically download or the PDF may open up in another window. Most browsers will open the PDF in a browser window. You can search the entire transcript for specific words, names, or places by using the browser's built-in search function. For example, we can search on the word Pahu. We see Pahu comes up two times when Uncle George Naope is speaking. Use the arrows to see additional results of your search. The third occurrence of Pahu is on page 18, and we can see, in writing, Auntie Pulu's story from the video clip we shared with you. Some browsers automatically download a PDF and do not open in a web browser like this. Locate the downloaded PDF on your computer, open the file, and use Adobe's built-in search feature to look for key terms. Let's return now to the record for this panel presentation. You can also look at photos taken during the event. To scroll in the carousel, you can simply click on the next thumbnail to see what is included. Lastly, a research tool called a finding aid is also available. It can help you narrow down areas of interest before doing more in-depth research. You can readily identify a finding aid in the items carousel because it is green, while transcripts are orange. Like the transcript files, a PDF will either display in a browser window or automatically download. Additional information for this digital heritage item record and the panel itself can be found in the right-hand column of the page and at the bottom of the page. There are also digital heritage item records for oral history interviews HPS conducted with Antipulu. These are easily distinguishable from events as they are labeled with Antipulu's name, followed by the date of the interview. These records may also contain downloadable PDF transcripts and finding aids to assist in your research, along with photos taken by HPS during the interviews. The last kind of research tool you may find in an elder's collection is a footage list. Let's take a look at Auntie Pulu's. This list is a PDF and again may open in your web browser or automatically download. Footage lists are colored blue. This listing offers details on HPS footage we have related to Auntie Pulu in the archive, including various performances, and graduation rights. Most of these resources are not available online, so please feel free to contact us about something in particular. Let's take in a little more of Auntie's story about her Pahu and Kaulilua. She participated in a 2003 HPS panel discussion held at the Bishop Museum. Kumu George Holokai is seated next to her. Go to the Pahu. Do your Kaulilua go on. I said, I'll do the other two first. No, Kaulilua. <laughs> okay. So I start, in the minute, and I could see her face goes. <laughs> like, it was so terrible. And I'm looking at her, and she says, go home, try again. Oh, and I used to walk out of that halal. I used to be very ill inside. I, the third time she told me to go home, I wanted to quit. I went out there and told my husband, that's it, I'm going to quit. Because you see, in our days, we were not given the song, you have to do your own research. There were no papers like we do today, no nothing. So you have to study the words, go find it, or do something on your own to get the words. And I know, she, I even bought my tape recorder. She says, take that back out. You're not allowed, no tape recorder. So I learned my hula by heart, let's say it, by heart, all in here. Besides the two kumu that can be seen in this clip, three more hula masters were on the HPS panel that day, including Uncle George Naope and Aunties Joan Lindsay and Edith McKinsey. Happy viewing!
We hope you enjoy your time learning about Dear Auntie Puluelo Naipo Park. We encourage you to explore other elder collections on Digital Umeke. If you need help with your research, have questions, or would like to inquire about other materials, please go to Research Inquiries at the top of the page. You will be taken to our HPS Archive page, where you can access our Archive Inquiry form. Mahalo for joining us! We can be reached at archive at hulapreservation.org. Mala mapono!